was the third state street day of clampdown in Jammu and Kashmir after the hanging of uh, parliament attack uh, accused Afzal Guru. Uh, well, my colleague uh, Nazir, in fact, uh, spoke with uh, the chief uh, postmaster general of uh, Jammu and Kashmir, John Samuel, to get us more clarity on the back and forth that's going on between the family and the government. The government says the family was informed by speed post on the hanging of Afzal Guru, but the family has denied that. The controversy over why Abzal Guru's family was not informed before he was hanged. The government of India says that as he, they were informed through a letter which was sent by Speed Post. And we can tell you after three days after his execution, the postal department has actually, what they say, physically delivered that letter to Abzal Guru's home, which was addressed to Tabassum Guru, wife of Abzal Guru. I am joined by Mr. John Samuel, who is the post, Chief Postmaster General, JNK Circle. Mr. Samuel, have you delivered the letter today? Uh, one of the speed port letters, which was booked from Srinagar, uh, from um, New Delhi GPO, addressed to um, Mrs. Tabasam Guru, the wife of uh, late Mr. Afsal Guru, was delivered this morning. Uh, the um, letter was booked late in the night. Um, uh, on 7th night or 8th early morning, mm -hmm. the Speed Post article was booked in New Delhi GPO. Uh, and this specific letter has been delivered today because uh, yesterday when, was when, Sunday. When did the GPO Srinagar receive that letter? Uh, GPO had received it on, um, uh, in, in, uh, in Srinagar it was received on 9th. Okay. This letter was booked on 8th and it was received in Srinagar on 9th. Right. And uh, the letter has to go to um, Baramulla, um, and uh, the next day is a holiday, that is Sunday's Sunday holiday. is holiday. So the article has been delivered today early morning. In fact, I spoke to one of the family members yesterday. They said uh, someone from the postal department had called them last evening, that is Sunday evening yesterday, that they want to deliver the letter. Uh, normally the speed post article we would like to deliver as quickly as possible, and since the letter has come and uh, the letter was lying with us, we would like we wanted to deliver it as quickly as possible. Yes. And um, uh, on Sunday, we had difficulty in delivering the article also. And uh, the earliest possible uh, delivery was on, on Monday morning. Um, but I'm not sure whether this is the uh, right Mr. article Mr. because... Uh, Mr. Samuel, you tell me, there's a, there's a lot of you know, security situation there. There are protests, there's curfew, complete curfew. Nobody is being allowed to get into the area. People are angry. How did you manage, post man, manage to get there and into the village? I would say that uh, the people of Jammu and Kashmir have enormous faith on post office. They have got enormous respect on postal services. In fact, the um, special effort that we have been taking to provide better postal services in Jammu and Kashmir has been well appreciated. And so this morning when the um, uh, post office arranged for the delivery, I don't think we faced any problem. In fact, the moment they realized that the post office wanted to deliver a letter, there was no difficulty. We were the postman was uh, allowed to go to the house of um, uh, yes, of Silguru, and uh, we were able to deliver it. There was so no what, difficulty. Any idea? Did your subordinate office tell you colleagues? They tell you what was what was the first reaction when family received the letter? Um, I'm I'm not aware of the re reaction of the family members, mm -hmm. um, but but they were but. They, they were cooperative. They, they did. All right, Nazir uh, Masoodi there in conversation with the Chief Postmaster General of Jammu and Kashmir, John Samuel, on the whereabouts of that letter, which has, in fact, been delivered uh, today by Speed Post. Uh, the family has, in fact, also told our correspondent that they have, in fact, received uh, that uh, letter.